Welcome back, guys. I've been busy. I've been busy. Let's crank this up. Um, I've been marking this area out for mining to be the same as this area. I Well, we've got a pull mood. Who's in the pull mood? Artie. Artie's in a pull mood. What's the matter with you, Artie? Cheer up, mate. Um, see what's wrong with him. Let's see what's wrong with him. Uh, oh, dear. Yeah, he's not very happy. Yeah, he's going to have a psychotic break. And I don't think there's a great deal we can do about it, so I'm just going to let him get on with it. Okay. Um, we've got a door there, haven't we? Yeah, we've just got an ordinary steel door. We need to get that replaced. Right, uh, let's go back to here. So, yeah, I need to keep a little bit of an eye on this because I need to make sure that this wall gets put, put in before we um, we do too much mining. Because if I mine out these before we put these walls in, this will collapse, <laughs> which, would, which would really not be a good thing. Um, is everybody asleep? Yeah, everybody's asleep. Let's crank it up to three times, get us through to the next day, and then we'll kind of get on with it. Who's in a poor mood now? Artie's still in a poor mood. Are you going to be feel better after a night's sleep? Yeah. He's, a, he's luxuriantly comfortable. He's eating a fine meal in an impressive dining room. So, yeah. He's rebuffed by Brandywine. That doesn't... Brandywine, can you just sleep with Artie, please? Like, cheer him up. Let's face it, a night, a night with Brandywine's going to cheer anyone up, isn't it? Come on. Right, so... Well, when he gets up in the morning, uh, hopefully he'll go and uh, get a bit of joy and be a bit happier. Oh, now, while I see this bear wandering around... I have made, I have made a, uh, a little change. Uh, oh, we've got a freaking solar flare. That's not good. Oh, man. See, that is going to shut down our hydroponics. So our plants will die. Oh, that's a shame. All right, never mind. <clears throat> I don't think they'll die completely, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. What was I going to talk about? I was going to talk about the animals. Right, let's go to animals. I have created a new animal area, animal area two, right? If we go to manage areas and animal area two, well, well that's, yeah, that's not the best way to show up. If I go to, uh, let's see, zone area and expand allowed area and go to animal area two, you will see that animal area two is the whole map, it's everywhere, except all the bedrooms and the battery room and the hospital okay now the reason I've done that is to stop the animals walking into people's bedrooms and disturbing their sleep okay so it's the kind of the, the first step on the way to controlling things so the animals are either restricted to animal area one which is uh, which is this area or animal area two which is uh, which is everywhere apart from those areas I just mentioned okay so that's that um, keep going what else did I do? Oh, I also changed the home area uh, and just redefined it, uh, which I'll show you. So the home area now covers uh, the whole of this. Oh, what have we got now? Oh, a manhunter pack. Pause. Let's have a look. Manhunter pack. Oh, oh, okay. We've got a pack of freaking manhunting rhinos, which are after Raven at the moment. Um these things take a fair bit of killing but see how many hit points have they got uh, does it tell me no but they're 270 270 meat which is quite a lot uh yeah so i'm hoping that we're going to be able to deal with them um does it give me i can't see i can't see hit points anywhere yeah, it's probably there somewhere and I just can't see it. Right, should we, um, okay, uh, oh, hang on, pause, because I need to restrict. Uh, so we restrict everybody to area one. Animals are restricted to animal area one. Right, there we go, boom. Although, the, I, to be honest, I didn't really need to restrict the animals. Um, I'd love to hunt this pack of deer, but to be honest, with these rhinos coming in, it kind of doesn't really matter. Yeah, God, they make a noise. Um, there's also a marble wall somewhere. Where is it? 
Oh yeah, this marble wall, I set that to be deconstructed. It's the only other thing I've, I've done. Right, so the rhino's coming through here. Ooh, good. Are they splitting up? Or oh, if they're going to come through half through there and half through there, that'd be kind of perfect. Oh, although, our freaking guns are down. No! Because of this stupid bloomin... Okay, so we're kind of trapped in our base at the moment. Well, which, you know, that's kind of okay. All the animals are going back to their animal area. Yeah, we kind of need the guns. Otherwise, we're kind of screwed. I mean, this is... I mean, it's not as bad as getting a raid, I suppose. But it's, um, it's pretty much as bad. Okay, right. Um, well, I guess we speed things up because... Oh, they're going to be banging on the doors. They're not going to be happy. And, of course, our guys are trapped inside. Can't do anything. Until the guns come online and start shooting these guys. Oh, come on, Solar Flare. Go the hell away. Oh, it's already lasted for five hours. Oh, man. It's not going to give up until tomorrow. Um, I really should turn off our batteries. But then I'd need to turn them on anyway to provide power. But... Um, now nah, we'll let the batteries charge up. What the hell? Uh, yeah, I think there's, uh, on the basis that there's kind of not a whole hell of a lot that we can do. Um, oh, the solar flare's ending. Aha! Okay. Right. Our guns should start coming online. Here we go and start shooting the rhinos. But these rhinos are going to be tough to take down unless all the guns come online at the same time. Okay, well, there's one rhino down at least. Come on, guy. Come on. Work, guns. That's another one down. Oh, here, now they're coming back online. Finally. They've taken out three of the guns already. There's another one down. Shoot this one. Come on, shoot this one. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it dead. Oh, down. Thank the Lord. All right, um, let's pause and we'll assess the damage. So, we need to replace... God, that was a bit brutal. We need to replace um, that one, that one, that one, and that one. Jeez. And then, well, we've got a whole bunch of slag, but duh that's not good all right well let's get everybody out so let's uh unrestrict everybody and then animals chaos is restricted to home the rest uh, all the huskies apart from the puppies although the puppies can start being trained now uh and then the muffalo and the grizzly bears you know what the muffalo should actually be kept in there it's just the grizzly bears we want to roam okay right we can let them and let them get on with it now. Oh there's, oh, there's still one here. Oops. Kill it, for God's sake. Before our people start wandering out there. Here they come. Kill it. Jesus, what does it take to kill this thing? Oh, Nanny. You, d you don't want to go up there. In fact, Nanny and Raven. Uh, let's draft you and just get you back in here for now. Oh, all right. Now I can un undraft you. There you go. Now you can get on with whatever you were doing. Right, cool. Holy crap. A whole pack of rhinos. We should get rhino horns, though. Should be kind of nice. All right, cool. Um, right, I need to go over here and check on this. All right, so th they did get that wall done, fortunately, which is going to stop all of this from collapsing. And then... The other thing I need to do is um, is is here put in a wall as well, which uh, yeah I can start doing. So let's get uh, structure and slate wall, and we'll start filling it in as they kind of go through. I should probably prioritise them, like Toby. As soon as you've done that, go and prioritise that one. need that and that dug out first. 
And actually, little Sarah, uh, come and prioritise mining over here rather than over there. In fact, prioritise mining down there, even better. And Chris, prioritise mining down there. Yeah, that's much better. Much better idea. Uh, Toby, he's going to go and eat. No. Um, oh, he's already mining it. Okay, he needs to go and eat. Get it finished. It's, you've almost finished. Oh, Yumi is pregnant. Or Yumi, whichever you want to, however you want to put it. Um, mind this middle bit so I can put the wall in, for God's sake. Bunch of slackers. Oh, oh! Hunter Billico has successfully tamed a grizzly bear. Grizzly bear three. <laughs> so we've got four grizzly bears now. How cool are we? Right, prioritise mining that slate. And let's uh, get that there, that there. Cool. No, don't mind that one. Do that one. There you go. That's better. They really want to do this instead of finishing these bits, don't they? What are you? Where are you off to? She's going to go and consume some berries. Now, does they, like if they're consuming berries and stuff, do they, have we got meals? Yeah, we got meals. Oh, they're getting all of these done. Well, we're we're getting lots of rhino hides. Actually, just before that dot, just before they chop it up. Uh, horn. Oh, there's a crack in it. I was just, I just wondered whether you could like extract them or something, but no, you can't. You can't. Is what it is. Don't think we've got any rhino horns, which is a bit of a shame. Any rhino horns over here? Yeah, don't think so. Maybe rhino horns isn't even a thing. It's eminently possible. It's the first time I've had rhinos, so there you go. All right. Well, crops is all good. Uh, we've got one rhino f refusing to die over there. He'll die eventually. Oh, Megatherium one. We've t oh, we've tamed a Megatherium. Oh my God. Grizzly bear and Megatherium. Sweet. Okay. Well, you are going to be restricted to. Okay. You need to be trained in hauling, and you need to be trained in hauling as well. And until you are. I'm going to restrict you to animal area one so that Jim can find Jim and the other people who are training can find you easily. Sky's getting on with repairing this stuff, which is really good. Sweet. Let's speed things up a little bit then. Oh, Sapphire is pregnant again. I hope she, I hope she doesn't lose it like last time because that was that was kind of heartbreaking. This statue is um, shoddy and rubbish. How can we? You haven't, seriously, you haven't got made any more statues, Toby? You slacker! Get on with it. Look at all the huskies. I think we need some more husky beds, don't we? <laughs> We're getting so many huskies; it's kind of crazy. But it's you know it's fine as long as we can feed them. Now let's hang on a second. I meant to check Ivo. Did I not set him up? Ah, oh, yeah, I've set him up for. Yeah, dislikes women and a pyromaniac. He should be, I don't know. Should we just release him? Because he's just taking up space. It's a good idea. Um, yeah, that's just, I was I was thinking of selling him, but I just can't, I can't I'm like massacring an innocent group of traders is, is one thing, but selling people into slavery, I just can't get along with. So um, we'll release him. Yeah, get out. Get the hell out. Should probably strip him first, but yeah, we'll just we'll just get rid of him. Yeah, yeah, he's set for release. Okay, uh, we're gonna break down of a solar generator. Oh, good. Well, Sky hopefully should get onto that. Let's look at the work. Uh, Sky is set for yeah, he's set for repairing, so he should be on the job. All right, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Um, are we dropping stuff here yet? No. Why are we not dumping any stuff there? That kind of surprises me. Uh, I can do a bit more of this wall. Let's get a bit more of this wall put in. So that needs to go down there. And that needs to go there. 
and we haven't started on that one yet. Okay. Uh, that wall we're putting in, which is the wall for these rooms. Okay, that's cool. So, I'm just thinking how this is going to be. This is going to be, it's going to be five, and then it's going to be six across here, isn't it? Yeah, so there should be a wall there, going up to there. And a wall there, going up to there. So we can put those in as well. And I need to figure out where the hell those are on the other side. So they're going to be... So that wall should actually go up to there, shouldn't it? Yeah, so that wall should go up to there. And then that wall should go up to there. And then that wall there and that there and that should go there and the same on the other side and I'm thinking the same there as well all right cool yeah all right we're getting it done getting it done now that does mean we're going to need doorways through here um, so I put the doorways in let's put the doorways in so these guys can actually get in and out of here so we want a plastic door there and one there cool and we're going to need the same down here as well eventually uh do i just put them in now i don't know yeah i think probably so there and there cool awesome now we don't have any power down here i don't think at the moment do we let's have a look do we have any power? No, we don't have any power running along here, so we kind of need to put that in. Um, how do we do it? I think we just like run it across there. Like, what the hell? I don't think we need to. I don't think we need to be fancy. Let's uh, let's uh, just let's run it all the way up there. Cool. Uh, oh, area revealed. Now, nah, now, let me show you because I I went round the map looking for little bits that we could mine or whatever and I found a couple of little areas but I think it's that area there so it's nothing and there's another one which is probably the same thing uh, I think it's just this area here so so no biggie no biggie cool how are we doing for steel we're up to 550 steel so we're kind of getting there considering that we are using steel for other things there they're really getting on with the mining. But they are also getting on with the walls. Which is really, really good. Because that will stop the, the whole freaking roof collapsing. So now I can do a bit more. I can do a bit more of these walls, can't I? Yeah, so. That wall should come down to there. And then that wall should be there. And then that wall should be there. Cool. And then that wall goes down to there. That wall goes down there. Alrighty, they really are cracking on with this mining. Their mining skills must be really going up because they're getting through this really quickly. I just want to like <laughs> make sure that none of them get crushed by falling falling ceilings. If I could, uh, if I could ensure that didn't happen, I'd be fairly pleased. All right, Toby, get on with that. Come on. Who's in a bad mood? I've no idea. Uh, that wall's going to go down there. Um, now, let me see. So, that's where we're going to have a wall there, isn't it? Yeah. So, that's going to go down there. And then there'll be a wall. That's one, two, three, four, five, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. And then that's where that wall starts coming down there. Good. All right, all right. If we can, if we can prevent people getting killed by cave-ins, we should be okay. And then we're going to need a wall there as well, aren't we? Let me go through there. Bears wandering around. You have a god old wonder. Just don't go in the bedrooms. That's the only thing. I, I'm just wondering if as many people are going through the hospital now. And I'm, they do seem to be going through through here. Oh, I didn't put the auto door on there, did I? Plasteel auto door. There. Cha-ching. 
Uh, two people are in terrible moods. What is the matter with everyone? Like, seriously, what the hell's the matter with them? Let's have a look at you. Now, his mood's picking up. Rebuffed by Brandy White. It's because we killed his brother. Just because we killed his brother, he's upset. Like, what the hell? Same with Vortex. Uh, oh, no. No, no, no. He's just hungry. And he's very joy-deprived. Why are you joy-deprived? Vortex. He's going to go and he's going to go and play some. Uh, yeah, he's going to go and play some billiards. The problem is, by the time he gets there, he probably hasn't got enough time to actually play because <laughs> he's so slow. Uh, there is a mod that you can get, uh, which is I think called extended surgery, which um, allows you to um, fix a brain injury like Vortex has uh, using. Have we, uh, have we picked it up? Yeah, we've picked it up. Using the AI Persona Core. Now, I don't know where that's got put. Oh, there it is, I think. There it is. Uh, yeah, you can use one of these to fix his brain injury. So, I don't know. We, like... We might, we, yeah, we might get around to doing that at some point. Install that mod and have a bit of play around with that. That'd be kind of fun. So, that wall should go down there. That wall should go down there. And I think that's uh, that can go there. I think that's about as much as we can do right now. Yep, that's as much as we can do right now. But oh, the base is really starting to come along. I can't wait until we've got this like completely finished. But we need a hell of a lot more steel before we can do that. We only got 380 steel, man. Now talking of steel, um, this. Let's, I'm going to pause this while I sort this out. This, this wooden equipment rack, um, only one problem with that. It's flammable, right? And storing artillery shells in a flammable thing, probably not a good idea. I forget who told me that, but somebody did. So I guess we'll uninstall that. Um, I'll, I'll reinstall it somewhere else at some point. So we'll get that uninstalled and we'll actually put in... Where are we? Where now? What is this? Furniture, isn't it? Here we go. Equipment rack. What are you? Now, there's no reason we can't make it out of something like slate, though. Let's put in a slate one. There. There we go. Cool. Alrighty. Uh, we've got all that lovely cloth coming in. Good. So we're actually going to have some. We're actually going to have some cloth in. Um. That's uranium. Yeah, what's that? That's hops. It should be in raw resources. I guess we haven't got any actually in stock yet. Oh, okay. Raid and we've got. Oh my god! We've got my great granddad turned up, and we've got Chris, we've got Chris's mother has turned up. Oh man. Oh, this is going to be brutal again. These relationships are a bit of a nightmare. But you know what, guys? If you want to see the outcome of this raid... I was actually going to end the episode there. But, um, but, but I've only been going like 20 minutes. So, yeah. I, I guess we, you're going to get this raid as well. So, let's go. Um, oh, pause. Let's, um, let's slow this down a bit. Restrict. Let's restrict everybody to area one. Animals. Um, yeah, let's restrict all the animals to animal area one. Cool. Right, off we go. Off we go. I think we can uh, we can speed this up. So, uh, who is this? There. Oh, hang on a second. Hang on a second. We've got one person who is both my great-grandfather and and Chrissy's father. Cajuela. Let's have a look. Cajuela, where are you? Let's have a look at your social. So, yeah. Uh, so, so, hang on a second. How the hell in... Oh, Chris and I are related. Oh, Chris, I, I didn't even know Chris and I. I or I'd forgotten. All right, okay, cool. 
Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, now I remember. Now I remember. Oh, you're going to get so killed. Yeah, you stand at the back throwing grenades. That's good. Right. Don't get killed. Don't get killed. Get captured, fine. But don't get killed. Oh, they're... Jumping straight in. Oh, man. They're getting very aggressive. Ivo! Ivo's back! We've already... We've already... Kicked your ass once. Oh, and they're dead. And... Where's Cahuelo? Where's Cahuelo? I can't... I can't see Cahuelo. Oh, are you... Oh, was Cahuelo one of these? No, that's Ivo. Well, that serves him right. That's Savage. That's yeah, whoever that is. Oh, was this... Oh, no! We killed Cahuelo! Oh, man. Why do we keep killing everybody's relatives? For God's sake. This one could be captured. What the hell? Okay, we're shooting this one, but he's not dying. Jesus, they're really giving us a pounding. Why are, why are we having trouble shooting this guy? Oh, got him. Ha ha. But these aren't giving up. Holy crap. Come on, go away, guys. We really need to, we really need to take some of these guys down. Come on, come on. You can do it. These guys are sneaking around the back. We've got two of our guns down. Presumably because of um, power cables missing or something. Oh, oh, now they're giving up. Ha ha. Right, well, we'll see if you get out. I think that's unlikely. Uh, you got, they've got personal shields, I suppose. So. But the whole... Uh, this is why I said the whole layout of this needs to be changed. Oh, come on. Can we nail him? No, apparently not. Oh, oh, we've got his shield. Right, so we've got Chimp. Uh, Chimp is capable of pretty much everything. Psychically hypersensitive. Oh, man. Okay, that's really not good, but... I mean, some reasonable, reasonable-ish skills. Then we got... Vice. And you're incapable of pretty much everything. Careful shooter. Prostophile. Good. Good skills. Oh, we want this guy for sure. And then, who's this guy? Virgil. Capable of everything. Psychically dull. Industrious. Heat tolerant. Oh, we want this guy. Right, these two we want for sure. Um, the other guy. This guy, Chimp. Yeah, I think we probably can just like leave him lying in the dirt. Um, so, um, Sky. Oh, I suppose I need to unrestrict everybody first, don't I? Yeah, unrestricted. And uh, I'll do the animals as well. So, Chaos the Cat. Uh, or... All of those up to the puppies. And the... Uh, oh my god. Look at this. One, two, three, four, four. We've got five grizzly bears and a megatherium. Ha <laughs> ha. Awesome sauce. Uh, this grizzly bear needs to be set to be trained for hauling. Um, and I've got people telling me that I really need to train them for rescue as well. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe we'll get around to that at some point. Um, okay, right, so, we want Sky, come and grab Vice, and uh, Artie, come and grab Virgil. Cool. Right, let's unrestrict their weapons. PDW, another charge rifle. Uh, any more of those? No, just one. And sniper rifle, oh, there's a sniper rifle up there. I forbid those. And frag grenades. What else? Oh, we just re finished res re researching explosive IEDs. Which is kind of cool. Uh, incendiary IEDs. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to skip that. 
Let's do. Oh, I don't know. Let's do. Let's do multi-barrel weapons just for a, just for a bit of a change. Uh, those we can unrestrict. Did any of these guys get shot? Maybe running over here, which would have been pretty stupid. But they do do stupid things sometimes. Um, right, that needs to get hooked up to the power. So let's let's get that done because it's a bit of an issue. Uh, let's run that there and up there. That's hooked up, so that's that's okay. Right, let's go back over here because I'm pretty sure that at least one. Of, yeah, see these guns. Um, see one, two, three. That's not where this should be. I don't think. I think this this cable should be further back. It should be like there. All right, well let's put it there for now. Okay, uh, yeah, I've put those to be done. Right, we need to mark all the steel to be hauled. And we've got all the bits and pieces. And yeah, I think we're, I think we're okay. I think we're good. All right. Whew, man. Uh, what are we running on, two times speed? Well, we are now. Right, let's go and have a look at this. Let's crank it up to three times speed, because... We've just had a we've just had an event. Oh, oh, and now ah now uh, that's a good point. I need these guys. Virgil, prisoner. Yes, he can have medicine. Yeah, we want to recruit him. And Vice, he can have medicine, and we definitely want to recruit him. So we got we got four potential good recruits. So yeah, and we've got bedrooms and stuff ready for them. We can feed them clothe them, arm them. Ooh, imagine if we can get another four people in. The things that we can do, and with all our animals as well. Oh, and we're actually getting the guns put back in. Wow, that's pretty impressive. We're repairing everything. Freaking awesome source. We've got, we've got power going on. I do need to get that cut down, don't I? Yeah, chop that down. Chop that down as well. Uh, yeah. Oh, good old Megatherium. Oh, Hunter lacks weapon. Who's that? Chris. Have you had another psychic break? It kind of looks like it. Yeah, she's wandering. There's her weapon. Let's unforbid that. That can be put away and we'll give her another one when, she's, uh, when she gets sorted out. Right, walls. Walls, walls, walls. Can we actually finish <laughs> the... I don't think we can quite finish, but I think we can get like kind of close to finishing the walls in here. Um, so there should be walls there, shouldn't there? And there. Uh, I say I can't do that wall there yet. Um, that's got done. Can I do that? No, I can't do that yet. But I can do that wall there. And that one there. So we've got that, that side. Should be a wall there. That side, that side. Can't do that one. Alright, well, yeah, well, I mean, we're almost done. We're all, we've are we almost got all the walls done there. Uh, over here, we can finish that. We can do that wall there. This wall there. And that down to there, at least. Alrighty. Oh, Chris is taking off for her clothes. <laughs> oh dear, Chris. What kind of state are you in? Wandering around, taking all your clothes off. Okay, you know what? I think, um, yeah, I think we, we, we'll leave it there then. So, can we get people recruited? And are you going to get your name in the game? Remember, it's, uh, it's hashtag, hashtag RimWorld name. And then, uh, and then whatever, whatever your name is, or whatever name you want to use, or whatever. Uh, we are getting up. There. It does seem like we're getting the hauling done. I'm very encouraged. All right, guys, we'll leave it there. The base is the ba the base is growing massively. Can we actually get it filled with stuff and rooms and equipment and do all kinds of cool things? And I, I tell you what, in the next episode, I, I'm really tempted to get on with the big power farm up here. Can I do it? Who knows? We'll find out. I'll catch you for the next one. Peace out.